Hi guys, that's me, and this is the second update on the Help for Hero Salamander's Razorback that I'll be doing. And here it is. So this is it in uh, in Razorback configuration. Of course, there's I'm yet to, to glue down this hatch. And uh, in my last video, I explained how to make the uh, the pop fit hatch there, so that you could put this bad boy on. And what I have done is I've made a little bit of progress on the, the back turret, so I decided that taking this apart was quite a laborious task. So instead, I've just decided to do a bit of magnetizing. So put a, if I just get that to focus, put a 3x2 disc magnet in there and shaved a little off the sides. And then I've just, I don't know you can see in there, I've just put a couple of magnets into the holes that would normally sort of pop onto there. Luckily, everything was uh, three mil wide anyway, so the magnets fit perfectly. And as long as you get them all in the same polarity, it just clicks in. And then of course you can do exactly the same with the heavy bolters, and they click in as well. And it's just a matter of, I haven't yet, just magnetizing that on top of there. I have, however, drilled out the barrels on there and also done the barrels there. They need a little bit of tidying up to make them look okay. And I uh, just need to do a little bit of work now to, uh, to these doors for when it's in its Rhino configuration. So what I'm thinking is attaching them together like that, maybe with some plastic card on the underside so that uh, you don't have to sort of mess around putting one of them on and then we well, see how, <laughs> how awkward it can be just there messing around putting those on like that but it should look fairly nice even as a even as a basic rhino I mean these the details on here look really nice I haven't yet uh, glued down the top bit but what I have done is I have put the magnets underneath which will work with the uh, the different upgrades you can give, like the spotlight and whatnot. So I've put one magnet underneath the side there, and another one underneath that side there. So the idea is that you can put all the other upgrades there. You can snap on the missile launcher or the storm bolt onto there, and the kit should be uh, quite flexible in theory. So that's my thinking, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, it'll work out all right. Okay, again, uh, for more information on the Help for Hero Salamanders project, there will be a link in the description of this video. And uh, yeah, looking forward to when those tickets come on sale and we can all jump on and buy some. And, uh, and then some very lucky person will win this ginormous and what's turning out to be fantastically painted uh, army. Right, so stay well guys, and I'll see you in the next one.